Hello there, Mon. Um, a great, kind of quite windy and tricky day out there on the bay today. First of all, just tell us what you were doing on the boat. What was your role today? Uh, so yeah, initially today I was on the chase boat. Um, so we kind of had a crew swap. Well, it was supposed to be about midway through the day. Um, so I ended up having a short sail uh, at the end um, in the trimmer pilot position. Okay. We saw some towing going on this morning, which gave us a bit of a surprise. Seemed to be plenty of breeze around. What was the what was the purpose of the two tow runs? Yeah. Yeah, so we're still trying to gather some data for the designers um, and there's some quite specific tests that they want to do under tow. Um, so that was the aim initially. Um, it took, it's fair to say that it was kind of surprising how windy it was when we first got out there. Um, and actually we kind of took ourselves back away under kind of Calamior area for the, for the hoist. The hoist um, happened pretty quickly and then the boat seemed a bit unstable on the side tow. Is that just one of the characteristics of these boats? Yeah, for sure. It's a kind of a tricky moment there with the, with the side tow. Um, it's quite, quite shifty as well. Um, and yeah, the boat's quite tippy, so um, we, we try and spend as little time as possible in that situation. But um, yeah, it got a bit fruity at, at, at times. Now, we noticed today that you had what we presume is your windier weather mainsail up, the M21. Um, I think. What can you tell us about that sail? We could see it looked like a different size, different shape maybe. Yeah, so uh, smaller, smaller mainsail. Um, obviously first time, well, we, we hoisted it the other day for a fit check um, and it was the first time sailing with it today. Um, so that was quite positive. Um, obviously we'll have a look at the, the shots of it uh, this evening and, and see where we go from there. We also saw you doing quite a lot of manoeuvres out on the bay, some plenty of foiling tacks, plenty of foiling jibes. Yeah. Did you did you have a tally of them in your head? Um, no, I'm not sure where we're up to now, but um, it was nice to kind of throw the boat around some corners. Um, the designers are giving us a bit of a free reign there now, so um, that was nice to, to kind of get, get, get grips with that um, and really to push the boat up range in, in the true in-speed range. We finished the day quite a long way offshore. The weather got quite inclement towards the end of the day, but we were about eight miles out. That's quite a long way offshore for uh, an America's Cup boat. I thought I was going to need my passport at one point. Yeah, <laughs> yeah no, we, did, we did get quite a long way out in the bay. Um, some kind of pretty bad weather was coming in over Palmer and um, we kind of had the call to, to drop sails and, and tow home and keep everything safe. Your, um, give me your feeling for the day. Was it a successful day for you guys? Yeah, I think everybody's pretty positive after today. Um, we've got some kind of good upwind downwind segments to kind of check in on. Um, again, new mainsail will be good, good to check in on. Uh, and as you say, the manoeuvres will be good to kind of have a look and see where we can improve those. That's great, Bladen. Thanks so much. Perfect, thank you.